how we could have the, this rubber gear on the track, and it could grab one marble and push it through. Um, and then it had a, we had a little gate. Yeah, a little gate or a little catch system. Mm -hmm. That yeah, after, oh, the line reader was in between, and it would um, we thought it would read it, open it, and then you know, cycle through problem. that. But this um, this instantly was problematic, and so was this one. So then you can tell them that. Uh, so we. Oh, yeah. So here we just made like a little, like a, a two-stage gate that just um, let one one in at a time. So, but when this slid over, it stopped. This other second gate stopped it at the and same the time, in and the line reader is just underneath. So, and then when it was ready to, when it, after it was done reading, it would open up the second gate, so it'd fall through, but it would still hold the ball, the marbles back here. And then when we're ready to feed another ball in, it would sweep all the way to the other side, let one in, it'd read it, and then the cycle, the sequence would go through again. And then this, when the line reader actually uh, read the actual value of the marble there, we just use a servo because servo was the actual motor we could use that we assigned it a number instead of using the encoder because the servo has actually has an encoder inside of it already. So just by troubleshooting where position we needed the cup to be in, we just plugged in values so we knew which uh, marble needed to go in which cup. And then this is just a little shield because light, the, the line reader is so sensitive that we needed the we needed to um, block the ambient sunlight coming into the door. So, so the, the software, which is the more important part than the hardware always. Yes, <laughs> def okay. definitely, I agree. Uh, task main is basically it calls four functions. Load marble, which opens the, the, the gate one way. Uh, sense the marble, okay? And then if it senses that there's a marble there, it continues on to select the bin. And uh, the function feeds it what marble type it was, what number of bins to go. And then drop marble, which is basically the server the other way, which kind of loads the next marble. So, and it just kind of loops until it doesn't sense anything. So, ready, set, go. There's a 0.4 second wait between each one of the functions to give it time to do its 